Hi, I'm Ignacio Guardia, Technical Support Manager here at BCN 3D, and this video is Metal 3D Printing Made Easy. There really are just three simple steps between you and having a 3D printed metal part like this one. Step one, printing. First things first, you will need a 3D printer and a metal printing kit, such as the BCN 3D metal pack, which by the way, it's super easy to install. Inside, you will find specialized hardens, brass wipers, and the trusty Magic Group Pro Metal. Our pack provides two filaments from BASF Forward AM, Ultrafuse 316L and 174PH. Since these materials contain high levels of stainless steel in combination with polymer binders, printing remains easy peasy. And with the hot and end, your filament will always extrude smoothly. Step 2. Debinding. This process has to be done externally. With us, through forward AM's current authorized network of suppliers. Here, the polymer binder content from the printed part is removed while the metal powder remains, a thermal technique otherwise known as catalytic dividing. And finally, step three, sintering. This process should also be externalized. Here, the part undergoes a sintering process at temperatures just below the melting temperature of the metal, which causes the metal particles to fuse together. The material then reaches its final state through post-sintering, where it gains required attributes in aspects such as hardness and strength. The result is a final part which is almost 100% solid stainless steel. Since these metal printed pieces can be treated in the same manner as steel manufactured parts, you have a wide range of possibilities to improve the finish of your model. You are free to remove supports by cutting, you can polish the model, you can join and repair pieces by soldering, as well as drill, bore, and you can even thread holes. Are you already thinking about what you can create? Let me show you some examples. This end use part can be used as a replacement for a machine propeller since Ultrafuse 316L is resistant to seawater and chemicals. This longboard axis can be optimized using additive manufacturing to achieve a more complex and lightweight structure. And this blowing cone is an end use part used to blow air into bags which are later filled with juice, yogurt and other types of food. If you need any more information regarding 3D printing with metal, visit our knowledge base created by our support team or get in touch directly with us. And happy printing!